This video was made possible by the Content Creator Program. An MCOC champion is temporarily granted to select accounts for the purpose of allowing the community a first look at a new champion coming to the contest. All granted champions are removed from accounts before they are officially released to the community. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So the first look video was already too long, so I decided to break this up and this is another video of just some gameplay. So when we were fighting Winter Soldier, I did one of the pre-fight abilities and I wanted to test out that lifesteal. And I decided to come in here, uncollected mode, but you see that short burst <laughs> damage lockdown? Uh, not the best choice to test out the pre-fight ability for stability. Okay, but with that said, we will get a chance to see it. It just takes a little bit longer. I have to wait out, you know, the uh, cool down there, the timer, before I can actually see what it looks like. Now, in the video, previous video, I mentioned how the lifesteal seemed a bit weak. This is why, because I had gone through here. So, all right, we've got the heel block off. So now watch here, okay? Uh, she evaded, but you'll see every once in a while, the lifesteal will come up. I'm not able to do what I'd like to do here. So we're getting a little uh, degen, you know, on her. And there we go. We fired off the special two, but we didn't have that pre-fight ability for the uh, crits. So it didn't really do much of anything. So at this point, I'm like, all right, I got my combo shields up. And what I want to do is I want to make sure that I end this fight with a special three. That way I'll start the next fight with a hundred hits and we should have a much better time. I'll do the combo shield again and life will be good. Uh, and that's my thoughts. So because she evades a lot, not able to get, you know, what I would like to see out of this too much, but here we go. Now we just want to get her down uh, to below 5%. Once she's below 5% health, we will be able to launch that special three and it'll take her out no matter whether she's at one, two, three, or four. I didn't test it with 5%, but yeah, she's at 4% and that's it. Lights out. So you can see we have 67, 68, 69, uh, 71 hits after that special three, but we're going to start the next fight with a hundred. So I just wanted to go right straight up the middle. Like I said, I could have chosen better. Uh, we had a couple of other options. I was looking at that vision cause I remember the pain of trying to deal with him. Uh, but in any case, now we've got to fight. Stealth Spider-Man. Now, I hate fighting Stealth Spider-Man. And I was running out of time, and I'm like, you know what? Let's just keep going. I've already used up energy. Uh, I would have chosen a different path, guaranteed. Definitely didn't want to deal with not only the, uh, uh, the link node there, but also Stealth Spidey. But we get a chance to see how she works with a, you know, a little bit of a challenging fight, at least for me. All right, so you see here, I'm building up, got the max two of the uh, combo shields. That's why I fired off those two heavies in the beginning. And you can see she is doing some damage. She's over 100 hit combo, and her damage is just going to keep going up. You see the life steal? All right, now I'm watching it, and I'm just like, okay, that just doesn't seem very strong. If I fire off a special, I'm going to get that recoil damage, right? But I was not confident that her lifesteal would compensate for it. And of course, you see I'm taking a lot of uh, damage on my block. But she seems capable. I don't know if I like the lifesteal but I have another test later on in the uh, in the video. Uh, we're going to fight Korg. 
and you'll get to see how her life steal works there because she gets a life steal off her medium. And as you know, with Korg, you get damage back when you hit him with a medium, uh, any medium that makes contact. All right. So again, we were able to finish the fight uh, with a special three. And so we have uh, one hit, 100 hits on our combo meter starting off. Now, we're not going to go through the entire uh, path. Just these few fights here. Uh, this is the last fight of this particular quest. And then we're going to go into uh, one of the other chapters and fight there. Because, I, like I said, I, I really should have changed uh, paths or something like that. But uh, I just decided to go ahead and, and see how she worked. Okay, so you see she's got that heal block and armor uh, break or shatter on right there in the beginning. Now it's gone. So now I'm getting the life steal. Okay, and you can see her life steal was working, but what you just saw there was her ability, uh, her heal ability. All right, so that's actually pretty good. It makes her pretty sustainable. As long as you can survive this fight, you are going to get that heal uh, if you start the next fight below 15% or if you get below 15% during the next fight, you're getting that heal. So she is pretty sustainable, even if the lifesteal uh, isn't as strong as I would have liked to have seen it. All right, so here we go. Now, I did this, but I decided not to continue, but I'm just sort of keeping in practice uh, to finish the fight with a special three when they are below 5% health. It's a guaranteed kill, and you will start the fight with 100 hits of your combo meter. All right, so we're going to end this video with a fight that I was trying to test her stability function pre-fight ability against Korg, and I'm a little confused. So I'm going to show you guys what I was trying to do. Uh, I wanted to see whether that lifesteal uh, on her mediums uh, would give her enough health back to deal with Korg's uh, damage back. But if you look to the left, I don't see lifesteal proccing at all. Now, I know that Korg, uh, with his shield up, wasn't going to take a lot of damage, okay? But now his shield is down. Where are her lifesteal? I don't understand why I'm not getting lifesteal here. So if somebody could explain that to me, I'd be most appreciative. Again, this is my first look, so I'm just playing around with her. I'm trying her out. Uh, there we go. Her self-repair had to kick in to save my life. Uh, you see me there trying to fire off uh, some uh, light intercepts, and they weren't working. Again, I'm not used to her animations, her movements. So I'm just trying a lot of things here. Uh, but in the end, I was taking a lot of damage. So I'm like, okay, well, that failed. I fired off the special three to get rid of that shield because I knew that I wasn't going to be able to get the uh, light intercepts just because I'm not good at doing that. Uh, so I wanted to get rid of that shield quick so that I could fight him normally. Uh, there you see me. I'm just using my light attacks here. And I'm just like, okay, I got to do this. She's almost dead, but I got to do it. See how I was trying to do a light attack right there? And there we go. That time I got it. That's what you want to do. Uh, and you can do that with anyone. I just don't do that well. So I'm looking at his shield and I'm just like, okay, we got him. Okay. So in the end, clutch, but we did defeat him. Could have fought that much better, but this is what the testing is all about. So I don't know why I did not see her lifesteal proccing. Uh, I don't think there was any um, global. I checked and all he had on him was sadist. Uh, so I don't know whether there was some ability reduction. Uh, I need to go look at Korg a little bit, find out whether he has some sort of ability uh, accuracy reduction, but I expected to see her lifesteal. And although with the shield up, she wouldn't be doing a lot of damage, 
and her life steal works off of a percentage of the damage dealt. So if she's not dealing a lot of damage, the life steal is not going to give her a lot of health, but I still expected to see something. I expected her to get some health back. So I have to look into that a little bit, find out what was going on. Maybe it's some weird interaction with Korg, or maybe it's an ability I just don't realize or have forgotten uh, about Korg. And that's why she wasn't firing it off or something I just don't understand about her. Again, this is just my initial first look of this champion. All right, but that's gonna do it guys. Uh, a little more gameplay than the first look video had. Hopefully you found this one entertaining, uh, informative, helps you make your decision. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. If you can leave in the comments, if you have an answer to why she wasn't procking her lifesteal, feel free to leave that in the comments. All right, and you all have a blessed day.